Tim Ritter's Killing Spree. It's from 1989. And this is a Gorehound's fucking dream. <laughs> I honestly wasn't overly excited going into this movie. But sometimes that's the best way to go in because this this flick blew me away so it's still Monday uh, the same day I watched Opera Mortem I'm sure you could tell how fucking exhausted I was in that but uh, this movie this one tended to wake me up a little bit. Um, so it's about this dude whose name I don't fucking remember. Uh, Tom Russo is convinced that his new wife is fucking everybody in the neighborhood. <laughs> and so when she goes away on a business trip, he starts killing everybody that he believes had sex with his wife. And the kills are amazing. <laughs> There's machetes on ceiling fans. There's a wicked, uh, almost a chainsaw, lawnmower kill. I love seeing people get killed with lawnmowers. It's not something you see in a lot of movies. And I just love seeing it. Uh, I think my favorite lawnmower kill was probably in uh, Dead Alive when the priest straps it to his chest. Um, there's a wicked, wicked wicked hammer scene in this movie I love how he keeps it under his pant leg the way most people keep a small gun or a knife strapped in their boot this dude keeps a hammer and he uses it to de-jaw someone um, but once he gets all these people dead uh, that's not the end of it because then, for whatever unexplained reason, or maybe it was explained and I fucking missed it, but uh, they come back from the dead, and now there's zombies coming to get revenge on Tom. <laughs> it's fucking absurd. Thankfully, the zombie bit is not very long. The zombies are in it for like, what was it, like the last 20 minutes or so, 25 minutes. Uh, this Blu-ray is an extended cut. It's an extra 15 minutes. Um, IMDB says the standard cut is like 90 minutes. This was an hour 45. Lots of extras on the Blu-ray. I haven't checked them out. I'm not generally not very big on extras. Just want to watch the movies. Um, if you're if, if you like the old cheesy splattery horror, you need this flick in your fucking collection. Um, I grabbed mine. Pretty sure I got mine from Grindhouse Video. So many movies showed up last month, I don't remember where they all came from, but I'm like 98% sure this is a Grindhouse Video purchase. Um, I know he's got, I'm pretty sure he's got more of them, so get on that shit. Get this flick in your goddamn collection. Um, this one's actually got me wanting to go and uh, 
Actually, no. Fuck. This is put out by uh, SRS. Yeah, SRS Cinema. But I'm still pretty sure I got it from Grindhouse. Um, <laughs> so yeah, if you can't find it on Grindhouse, or if you can't find it on SRS Cinema's website, jump over to Grindhouse. But yeah, you need this flick. This, the performance put on from uh, the dude who plays Tom. I, on IMDb, they said his name is Asbestos Felt. I've never heard that name before in my life. That is a fucking wicked name. And I need to see if he's been in more movies because his performance in Killing Spree was fucking amazing. Uh, you truly, truly felt like you were with him on his mental downfall. Um, the way he starts seeing shit in his brain and the way they portray it in the film, it was beautiful. Uh, the soundtrack was awesome. Uh, it fit this movie really well. Uh, everything about this movie just meshed so well together to make it one of the most fun viewing experiences I've had in a, in a bit. Uh, just amazing. Uh, his performance actually kind of reminds me of uh, Michael Todd Schneider a bit and just the way they they can channel this whole other persona and have the viewer believing they are what they are and have you feeling like you're right there experiencing everything with them just just fucking great uh, his acting was superb um, some of the other actors not so superb but it still fit the style of the movie like uh, dude who played his best friend that fucking sleazeball <laughs> he, was, he was a little uh, a little on the cheese side but and the old lady neighbor, oh god, she fucking cracked me up. Getting after him for, for killing people, and then she's like, there, "There's, there's no, there's no satanic beliefs in my town. You can't be having those here. You, you can't be killing people in my town. Unless I can get in on the action." <laughs> she fucking cracked me up, man. Um, what else? What else? Like, really? Like, just just get this movie, Killing Spree by Tom or Tim Ritter. It is a 1989 movie. I don't know if the Blu-rays are how or how limited these are. Hopefully, you guys can get one. Uh, according to this cover, uh, the design and layout. And all that was copyright on 2015, so five years ago. Hopefully, you folks can get it. I got one, so shouldn't be too too difficult. But yeah, killing spree. It is a goddamn blast of a movie. Go buy it. You need this in your fucking collection. Peace out, motherfuckers. Stay sleazy.